Hello from Taj Mahal. Medics, I've got a Hyundai Gets here on a 2006 plate, 2006-2007. Just replacing the low beam bulb on the driver's side front. As you can see, that one there is working. This one isn't. Now, what this bulb does, it does the full beam and the low beam. It's a H4 bulb, and if you didn't want one, you can. If you did want one, you can find a link for it in the description, and you can get one from there. Or or uh, there'll be a link for it at the end of the video as well so I'm just gonna show you exactly what I mean and how to replace it as well so full beam if I do this as you can see now that there has gone brighter that there has gone brighter but I think on the other side the bulb is fitted in correctly so we're just gonna see that as well so at least you know what I'm talking about now you can see on the inside there that bulb there is not sitting in properly so that's the reason um, he's got uh, the beam image is incorrect and now we're gonna have a problem with I can see the spring as well so we'll try anyway we'll sort that one out and I'm just gonna show you how to replace this one engine off now you've got the cover right there so I am on my own just gotta bear with me one second right that cover there so what I do I twist that to my left take the cover off make sure you don't drop the cover once you take the cover out now just remember the seal around here so that's there so then you've got the bulb holder right there so what I'm going to do I'm going to disconnect the plug so what you do with this plug you've got a wiggle wiggle they do get really tight that's it that's out as you can see I'm just going to move the wire to the side, so push it to the side. Now you can see the spring. That there, you need to push in that way and then pull the spring out. Now just remember how the bulb sits in, that's, that's exactly how you want to put it back in as well. So I'm just going to zoom out a little bit. Now if I push the spring in, push it to my left and then pull it out. That's it. I then pull the plug out, uh, the bulb out, sorry. There we go. The bulb is out as well. So you've got the two pin locators, they were facing down, and then the a single pin locator was facing up. I'm just gonna bring the spring back up again. Put that up. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get the new bulb. Slot the bulb in, like I said to you, the locator, so that's one, that's two, and the single one is on the top. So that's how the bulb sits in, and if you fit it in incorrectly, like I said on the other side, the image on the other side is really bad. That was the reason it's bad. So I'm going to slot the bulb in now. It's a new one right here. You can find the link for it in the description. And if you have found this video useful, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe where possible. And um, there's a special thanks button as well. Don't forget to click on that. All right, put that in there now. What I now need to do is line it up. Not lined up yet. So the bulb's in there now. Just need to make sure it's lined up at the moment it isn't you can see there already so what i'm going to do i'm going to try to wedge my hand in from the back here take the bulb out and then slot the bulb in again make sure it sits in perfect now this is brilliant bring the spring down and connect it so you can see the locator on that side there is sitting perfect the locator for the bulb on the other side is sitting perfect and on the top as well so all i now do is plug it back in That's it, put the cover back on. Don't forget, you should put the cover back on. That's it, that's all done. So what we're gonna now do is check, see if the lights are working. Now you can see there now, that's working. As well as the other side. Now we'll check the four beam as well. Now you see that four beam is brilliant. Now see the image on that side is really bad, the image on this side is brilliant, you can see the line across it and for the high beam as well.
That's all you had to do on this particular model. Sorry, uh, I was on my own recording this as well, so it was a bit difficult. But hope you uh, understood what I was doing and you saw what I was doing as well. And you find this video quite useful for yourself and hope you change the bulb as well. And um, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.